97% security guard get born. So if you find yourself now, go 3% there, there with a security guard, and yeah, yeah, that's fine. Me live with this woman, you know, in my yard, you know, most of the night work me, you know, in a security guard, you know. So, go on to work and come on my morning, come on my morning, and see a man glasses for my dresser. So I said, baby, come here. Because I know man, I said, you know wear glasses. Me no wear glasses. Oh, we have a glasses for the, for the dresser. I said, where it come from? I said, oh, you know, say one girl left it up at her workplace. And me take it up and put it in bag and carry it home. No, this is a man glasses we are talking about, you know. I said, no, but this is a man glasses. So what do you tell me? Say, I, I'm, no, she started getting down from me. She know I'm mean, dig no deeper in the story. You know? She just wanted it done, you know. All right, listen me now. I said, all right. I don't give up the glasses there, you know. I carry the glasses and go up on my workplace and lock it up in my locker, you know. I don't give up this, you know. So I carry the glasses and go there. I notice the next day, you have a brother who lives next door to me, you know. Every time I pass that man, you know, that man always a knock off me. Boy, I feel like I'm a long time you're singing, you know, man. I'm more your boss, you know, man. You're more your boss, man. You're a big artist, you know, man. No, it's when you see a person that big you up every time you pass them. Be careful, you know. I notice after I carry the glasses there and go up on my workplace you know, and, and lock with the glasses there you now. I notice the man there with the glasses again, you know. Tomorrow pass, he never had no glasses there. And he always wearing glasses, you know. So over time, I realized, say, uh, him, as me gone to work at daytime, time, him in my house with my woman you know, at night time. As me gone to work at night, him in my house with my woman, you know. And then I just think, you know, everybody by the party, you know, I'm going, you know, me alone don't have a clue, you know. Come on, what, baby, everything all right. And me alone don't know everybody, you know. So I go to my grandmother and I say to my grandma, and I say, grandma, boy, I'm get hurt by love again, you know, grandma. Grandma, how about we if you put words sometime, you know, I tell you, you know. I said, grandma, I'm get hurt by love again, boy, I'm going to know if you do. Grandma, I said, Philip, come here. Come sit down right there, so. I never forget it, you know. My grandma said to me, I said, Philip, let me tell you this. In life, love and cherish the person who love you and not the one that you love. People me sit down, you know, and take me, take me some time for unraveling what grandma just say, you know. I'm going to repeat it again, you know. Grandma said, in life, make sure you love and cherish the person who love you, but not the one that you love. Boy, that's something there. It take me some time to sit down and think of what grandma just say, you know. But me I tell you, say, grandma, have a way to put to words sometime, where you have to sit down and figure it out, you know. But them correct, you know. Them correct, you know. So make sure you love the person person who love you treat them best and not the one that you love it let me tell you what grandma mean it means you will see a nice girl now you run after her and give her everything what you want what she wants me and give her the world you know because you love her but she don't love you so yeah we all of that now go work you know you have enough that problem because you love her she don't love you so yeah we yes love the one that love you she said yes